Welcome everybody. I'm back y'all with another video. So this is going to be the In My Feelings segment, okay? I'm using In My Feelings here. All right, so we're gonna see what's, what wants to be said and what maybe isn't being said. All right, so if you're interested guys in booking a personal, I am doing same day as well as next day readings. That information is in the drop box below. As well, guys, go ahead and check out the website. The information is in the drop box below. All right. And you can utilize code SELL20. All right. To get 20% off your entire order. Okay. So, as well, if you're new to the channel, welcome. I'm happy to have you here. Go ahead and click the subscribe button. All right, so you can become part of our gang over here. All right, so let's get into it. I feel like some of you could be kind of nervous. You feel nervous about a, a person or situation. Maybe a little uh, anxiety. Yeah, like you may feel like you need to travel get out more enjoy yourself more because someone here could have upset you to tears okay somebody could have upset you so much to where it hurt your soul to where you actually cried okay this person makes you nervous the situation makes you nervous you may want some alone time to clear your head because i feel like some of y'all are extremely attached and emotional about this situation okay You're extremely nervous. Okay. I feel like some of you guys could be nervous because there could be some gossip going on. There could be some he say, she say. Okay. Yeah, like I said, anxiety here. This person is burning some sage, okay? Some of y'all need to go burn some sage. You need to cleanse your energy. Um, because I'm sensing a lot of anxiety. I'm sensing a lot of nervousness. A lot of, uh, some of you could be smoking or drinking. You know, emotional drinking. Emotional smoking. Um, there could be some gossip, some hearsay, some she say. That you may be nervous about getting out. Yeah, see, somebody here is extremely depressed, okay? Somebody here is sad. I feel like this is your person's energy. They could be depressed because they feel like you moved on from them. For some of you, there's actually a move. Some of you are... Somebody here could have wanted to go on a trip, a long-distance trip. I'm seeing that as well, too. And now they're upset. They're crying. I'm also seeing that somebody could uh, need to uh, take a trip to kind of get out of this funk that they're in. I'm getting like somebody could be really, really sad. I feel like this is your person's energy. You could actually be at a distance from this person. But somebody is definitely upset. Domesticated. Wow, somebody here has a family. And I'm getting a lot of, somebody's sleeping a lot. Somebody's sleeping a lot because they're going through anxiety and they're worrying themselves too much. And it's when and now it seems like someone is, um, energy is waning on their health, okay? Somebody here is definitely, there's definitely some nervousness, some anxiety going on here. Let me clear this energy up. Somebody's nervous of some gossip of some gossip getting out. Let's see what this gossip is about really quick here.
clarify gossip. Clarify gossip for me, please, Spirit. Thank you. Spiritualist. Searching for meaning in life, discovering the magic around you, manifestation and spirit realm. So gossip or hearsay is that somebody is spiritual. And then they're getting they're getting lots of attention and hearts and stuff on their social media sites. Somebody is being gassed. Um because they have branched out and went within. Okay? Somebody may feel like something is cap, okay? Somebody here is feeling maybe someone feels like that's cap. They not really like that. What they're saying is not true. Becoming someone you're not. Lies, bullshit, faking. Somebody feels like somebody is capping about their spirituality. Ooh, sipping tea. Yeah, see, somebody's over here sipping tea, listening to gossip. Like I said, there's lots of gossip going on here. And it's pertaining to somebody's glow up and their vibe. See, somebody was just struggling. Somebody was just struggling here. And now somebody's on fleek. Now, we got Stan here. We got a stalker, okay? Somebody either is going to start stalking or somebody is already stalking. So, somebody here is nervous because they're afraid of some gossip getting out. Tell me more about nervous. Somebody's in their feelings. Okay, we got older people here. We got older people. So somebody's nervous of what the elders are going to think. <laughs> the elders are over here in their feelings. The boomers, okay? We know who the boomers are. The 40 and up, 50 and up, okay? You know, they may have outdated opinions. They're out of touch. They're closed-minded, older, and re they resist change a lot, okay? Somebody's nervous because somebody feels as if somebody isn't going to accept somebody's... Um, spirituality okay somebody's slaying somebody's too savage for these boomers okay somebody here is is too too mighty <laughs> and it may make uh it may make others nervous okay i'm getting that at that too so somebody here is trying to clear their head of all of these emotions somebody here is also depressed as hell okay i'm feeling like this is some this is a, your partner's energy domesticated tell me more about domesticated please shipping somebody's throwing shade somebody's throwing shade about somebody's love life Okay, they believe in the relationship, wishing you to stay together, rooting for the partnership. But then you got a lot of people who's going to be throwing shade. Okay, so this is why you or someone that you're dealing with is nervous because they're afraid of the gossip. They're afraid to um, that what others are going to think. Okay, they may believe in this relationship, but they know a lot of people don't. Okay, so... Wow. Tell me more about clear headed. Appreciation. I hate nothing about you. Someone's family could be involved. We got family. Okay. They're, someone's family could be really playful. Like they may say, oh, my family, they just be playing. They don't mean no harm. But really, this person is kind of worried. Okay. Their family makes them feel anxious. Um, just because, like, I feel like someone doesn't approve of a relationship here. Someone doesn't approve. Tell me emotional. Home. Victory. This person is emotional because they want to be home. They want to rekindle. They want, uh, look at this. This person is love struck. This is your person's energy. This person is sad and they're stressed out. Okay, someone here could be living there happily ever after, or they want their happily ever after, and they're reminiscing about it. They're reminiscing about it, but their intuition is telling them they have to clear clear some things up first. Okay, there's gonna be a lots of gossip, lots of he say she say, and this makes this person nervous. 
Yep. They're nervous because indecision of their decisions that they previously made. Worried about what they were doing when they were coming from their ego. When they were doing things based off of their ego. Okay. Hmm. All right. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. All right. I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao for now.